Well, it's that time of the year, first tournament, well, in Team USA Trials, and hopefully it goes a lot better than last time. It all worked out, but I'd rather not leave it to chance this time. I'm trying to put some good ones together, and uh, y'all, you know, I'm not sick or broken this time, so we should be good to go. That was a good one. We needed that. The first two games I felt like. Here we go. And then that third game. So here we go. So hopefully it's the second here we go and not the first one for the rest of the day. For the rest of the week. I'm also not a morning person, so it took me a little bit to get going. Hopefully I'll get better at that as the days go on. But we bought 8 a.m. every day. I'm a night owl. Good save. Was a good save. Minimal points today. Actually, this is a pretty good day. I think it's going to be at least top 10. A lot of guys are putting up some big numbers the last game, kind of close. But we did what we could. I kind of wish I just trusted to throw it slow on one shot that I made a pretty big move and it hooked every time on that lane, so I didn't really trust it. But good day. I wanted to let you guys know that we officially launched our brand new merch store, DynastyBowl.com. We've kept all of our best sellers from the League Night shop and plan to come out with some new designs very soon. Check out the link in the description below and use code DYNASTY for 20% off your entire order. Everything, 20% off.
That's what I get for score watching. I saw Brandon Bone finished at 145. I was like, I get them all. We tie, and the last one I, I duffed it, but I got nine. It's all good. It's a great score today. So my goal was to split less than yesterday, and I think I only had two today. Seven open frames. Today, 22, and my score was about 60 lower. But not as many strikes to be had today. We're looking pretty good after two days. to be a good bowler the ratio is a little higher today which means they're they're a little easier I try to throw a reactive ball the first three frames had the yips left toe <laughs> left toe then i made another ball change to a different reactive ball moved an arrow left threw it good it jackknife i basically went high every shot the first three shots and then i was like you know what i know i can hit the pocket with the urethane ball and it just happened to strike nine times so good things do happen sometimes <laughs> last two pairs, day and night. Last one, they were curving a ton. This pair, they're not covering much at all. Hopefully we don't miss for the rest of the block. Hello. Good bowling. Thanks. Not so good bowling? I mean, it could be worse for sure. This week's over. It's just not not my best performance, that's for sure. I think, I just think it's mixed up enough and enough of the really good bowlers aren't bowling great this week to where mm. the point total is going to be fairly high this year. And I definitely think the next two days are going to be, well, obviously are going to be more challenging than today, but I think they could be two of the harder days. Um, so. Which is where you shine. I think so. He doesn't <laughs> shoot himself in the foot nearly as hard as other people do. Yeah, so. Tomorrow is moving day. Day four is moving day. So that's when things are really going to shake up. Yeah, I think I give myself a little top 10, top 10, back, back to back to, to end it. And I, I like my chances. I, I can see Chris winning the next two days. If anybody can do it in the field, it's Mr. Bob. <laughs> they get longer and longer, right? They do. Yeah. 40, 43 and 45. The shape of the pattern is very different though. So, Lofting. The location of which we were going to play will be fairly different. I have a hard time believing we will be lofting tomorrow. Oh. Unless some wild things tend to happen during the block. The last day, yeah, there's a strong chance. It's going to be a long pattern that we play to the right and then long pattern where everyone's going to start with the left gun. Can't wait. He's one of the best at lofting. Yeah. <laughs> you bowl pretty good when I show up late. I'd like to think I just bowl pretty good, period. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> I did bowl pretty good the first game. I had maybe two bad shots. I bowled 250. I miss hit one in the ninth, a half seven. So I was like, you know what, that was on me. I feel pretty good, I'm bowling good. 
not really thinking about much, just playing the game. Bonus to split or a double, and uh, we're still rolling, so hopefully we can do it for the next 10 games. Not very happy with today. Had a couple of good games. Didn't manage ball reaction very good today. I don't feel like I bowled bad, I just didn't do the right thing. And it led to not a lot of score, so. Uh, I had 107 over today. All of it was in two games, which I had good ball reaction. I just needed to be a little smarter, I guess. Make different decisions, but we should still be in a very good spot going into two Just doesn't feel very good because I was pretty much scraping for two and a half games. Just try to be a little bit better about our decision making tomorrow. Hello, it's day five. Currently in second place by one point. Finished game one. I struck in the first frame and almost never struck again. Hopefully some uh, better ball reaction. I'm not going to complain about carry because I know that is directly correlated to ball reaction. Probably like I bowled a pretty good game. And I'm just continuing the trend from yesterday. Not great ball reaction. Your yep. position seems to be quite favorable. Yeah, we have one more game of bowling. Like Kobe said, job's not done yet. He can do it, I believe. Just gonna play one more game, one minute at a time. We'll see where the chips fall, and then we'll call it a day. And a week. And a week. What we're not gonna have is the same situation as last year where we're shitting bricks for hours, so. That'd be nice. Safe well, speak for yourself. Well, <laughs> we'll be uh, gassing him up, hopefully. Uh, and, and Via, and Packy. Yeah, Everyone Packy. except you. Everybody in the house. Everybody's staying at my house. Hopefully, fingers crossed. There's 
actually one year where everybody that stayed at my house made the team except for me. That one felt kind of bad. Champion? I'm gonna go gather up all the balls I have in the paddock <laughs> and bring them in the car. Get them ready for Wichita. Oh uh, yeah, so no rest. We have the first major, first tournament, and we have one day of travel in between before that starts. So um, if I could use this and just keep rolling, fantastic. Uh, would a break have been nice? Absolutely, because five straight days of bowling, a little rough, but and you got, this is what we do! And you got PBA League on Tuesday. Alright, well, <laughs> we got a handful of things. Hey, your first event with the LAX. Yeah. I'm sure Bowen's happy to know that I'm bowling okay. I like how the IQ yeah. Ruby and the IQ Gear thing almost look the same. Yeah. Well, if you guys want to know what I threw this week, I threw this one a little bit. I threw this one for about um, way more than I should have. Uh, I also threw this one a little bit. I did throw that one. Nope, we're not going to talk about that one. Didn't throw this one at all. Or that. Well, I threw that once and I washed out. Didn't throw either of these all week. But when you bowl on <coughs> pretty much the same oils, the same balls are gonna look good. Basically, none of the cleaner stuff, huh? Uh, the clean balls were not good. There was a lot of oil on the lane this week, so a lot of strong balls with weaker layouts make it a little smoother and control the pocket. That's what you gotta do with this tournament. Control the pocket because uh, I think an automatic spot on average is gonna be <coughs> about 25th a day. Realistically, that's not a lot. Good bowler. <laughs> also good bowler. So I stream on Twitch. The link is in the description below. Come drop your primes. Do we really ask this question? All right. Do you guys fold or do you crumple? No context. I'm leaving it at that. Wait, did, you, you fold? He folds and then why do you fold? Yeah. What's your excuse? Oh, I'm a crumpler. I'm not a part of. That's what I'm saying. He said it's because we're Asian. Are you proud of Darren? Very proud. Glad to be here. And please welcome the 2024 Men's Team Trial right here in Las Vegas, Darren Tang. Dude, hey, you have a question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you fold or crumple your toilet paper? <laughs> I just... What? <coughs> Stop it. I know we, we need to know. It's like the top... It's the question of the day. Right. Proud of you, buddy. Thank you. Yeah. Do I fold or crumple? Crumple. Crumple. <laughs> Thanks, Kelly. Especially after everything you crumple? Yes. Oh, no. Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so confused. Thank you. I think he was surprised that I asked the question, and he was like, I, I crumple, and then I fold, and then I, and then I, I didn't get a definitive answer. From Las Vegas, Nevada, Darren Tang. <laughs> oh, he's mic'd up too, folks. He's getting content. Wait, was, there, was, it, was it fold or crumple? It doesn't. What up, YouTube land? Team USA, right here. Darren should really be talking. He's not the doing his job. The microphones, on camera. Are, the microphones are. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> hey, Team USA here. This is oh, oh, weird. Oh. Did it again. The other one has a friend now. Where are you gonna put that? Right. Yeah, run it back. Ready? We're back. I think. Back. Well, the elbow's good. The neck's good. First week of the year, 2024 is looking pretty good. We got a PBA tour next week. Gonna be in Wichita for the players. We just gotta keep rolling because we're literally getting 
right into it. Chris and I leave tomorrow at 9.45 a.m. and then the PBA tour is off and running. So thanks for watching guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and make sure you hit that notification bell to be one of the first to see this video. Like, comment, and subscribe because we got PBA action for the next four months. Let's get it.